How's it? Today's Wednesday, August 16th. I'm still rebuilding, doing some jerk stuff and some snatch stuff today. I think today was pretty good. I felt a little bit rushed. I took Becca to the airport and then I had a meeting with one of two of my managers at work because some things happened uh, the other day. But um, yeah, I mean, my, my lower back felt pretty good today. Um, given how bad Monday felt, I was expecting today to be a little bit more challenging overall. And thankfully, I was wrong. So I will, you know, take it slowly, but still be just really careful about how I progress everything here. Um, as far as it goes, I have basically a day to decide whether or not I want to lift at the American Open uh, Series 2 in Pleasanton in like a month. And I will talk with my coach later today, but I am leaning towards no. Just because one month to figure out if my... So many things to figure out, right? One month to do prep. One month to cut weight. One month to see if my back is okay. I I can't even like reg, deadlift regularly yet. So I I'm not healthy enough to be on a regular training program. And with that in mind, you know, one month is not very much to prepare for a meet starting from nothing. So if I postpone a meet until maybe October, which would be like the last opportunity I have to qualify for the American Open finals in South Carolina, is it North Carolina, I don't remember, then it would give me a proper training block and give me some time to really figure out whether or not my back is going to be okay. So I think we're going to opt out of this upcoming meet, unfortunately. But yeah, going back to today's training, it's still sticking with the push press plus the bad foot split jerk. So right foot forward and then the regular foot, which is my left foot forward and then the power jerk up to 100. So that's this set here. I think that Today was a little bit rushed, just because I was a little bit pressed for time. But I, I think that my, my back is feeling a lot better. Unracking the bar from the blocks doesn't seem to be as challenging as it was in the past and doesn't nearly feel as bad. Um, I also did this here, which is a push press at 110, which is the weight that I failed last week. So um, that's pretty cool. And then I moved into my put, uh, power jerks, sorry, at 116, which is three kilos up from last week. And for what it's worth, I think we're going to just continue increasing three kilos every week until the foreseeable future. Just because I'm still able to train, you know, like I talk about my back pain being a, a big issue, but it's it hasn't prevented me from lifting like altogether, you know. And so if I can slowly increase the variations that I do, three kilos every week for the snatch, the clean, the jerk, then realistically, even if my back is still hurting in eight weeks, I will still be a lot better off. You know, I would be strong enough if I can, can continue um, with this progression. I would be strong enough to, to qualify for the American Open Finals because that total is 240. And as it stands, you know, this week I did 79 for my snatch work, which was the block power snatch. And then I'm going to do that same weight on Friday. Um, and then if I increase for the next eight weeks, maybe 10 weeks, I, I'm not sure what the, the date is, but that will give me about 110, which is like insane to think about. Of course, those those variations will need to change. So from power snatch to full snatch to snatch from the ground or something like that, you know, um, those things are going to have to change. But just that progression, if I can keep it and modify the exercise itself, then I, I will be making a lot of progress. And same thing with the clean jerk, right? So if I do 99, which I did clean yesterday at 99, um, and then I did jerks today which is way over 99 but i'm going to do 99 again on friday if i increase 
another 30 kilos in 10 weeks or eight weeks would be 24 kilos. That would put me like one, what, 129, something like that. So um, I'll be right in the zone for, for everything. Going back to the workout today, I'm just doing my low block snatches here. Again, this is an opportunity for me to not necessarily focus on the bottom position, the start position, and more so focus on the overhead position because I think that is more important than my start position in general. I think that if I'm more comfortable in the bottom, like catching the, 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 the weight, then, then I will be a lot better off. Because the start position, I can start with the, my hips a little bit higher, a little bit lower here and there. And, and you know, it's kind of one of those things that I haven't been the most consistent on. And you know, today 66 is super light. Uh, this feels really good. So I, I didn't have any inhibitions as far as pain goes with my lower back. So that was awesome. I was dealing with a little bit of kind of discomfort in my right wrist, so we'll see what happens moving forward. I don't think it's going to be a big issue. But yeah, finished off with some back extensions and called it a day. It was really, really sweaty, uh, as you can see. But yeah, I'm, I'm super happy with how today felt just because I was worried for today. Wednesday was the day that I, you know, took a step back a couple weeks ago. And so um, for me to not have to do that again, it was really awesome. But yeah, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Shoots.